Okay, today's recipe, y'all, calls for some real ugly bananas. Today, I'm about to try to bake some banana bread. Now, disclaimer, sis is not a baker. She not. She really not. I didn't, I didn't uh, YouTube and Google this. They said I needed three ugly bananas, which I had because I didn't want to throw out my bananas. So they said, this is what you can use to make banana bread. These ugly bananas. One egg, sugar, flour, baking soda, salt, melted butter, a loaf pan. Seems real easy. Seems real easy. Let's get into it. Now, let me set my oven to 350. And start. Okay, we got a preheat going on. We moving along. Alright y'all, so now it's time to get everything all mixed up and together. We go see. We go see what happens. Okay, y'all, so far, so good. Everything is just coming together. See, now at this point, I'm nervous because when you start adding those like dry ingredients, that flour with that baking soda, that salt, see, this is when things can get a little screwy. See, I don't bake nothing from scratch, okay? I don't. So, this is very intimidating. But, I must say, I must say, this recipe was way easier than what I expected it to be. It was really, really, really simple.
Okay, so at this point, I'm like, why is my batter so light skinned? So something like something got to be missing. So I took it upon myself to add in some vanilla flavor and also a few sprinkles of brown sugar. Now, at, I did not know if this was going to knock the recipe off because, you know, bacon is a science. You know, one false move and you got some flat bread. So I was like, let me just step out on a limb because it just seemed like something was missing. Like, I don't know, like it should have been darker. I'm like, this is not what everybody's bread batter looked like on the Internet. So, as y'all can see, uh, the color really didn't change. So, we just gonna go with it, and we're gonna throw it in our loaf pan, and we're gonna get it in the oven. Okay, y'all, so the bread is done. Now, I want you guys to see me. Now, this is my first time baking banana bread. So here go the bread. It looked pretty good. It looked pretty doggone good. So now I'm about to see if it come out of this pan smoothly. So if it don't, y'all about to catch all the bloopers. Okay, here we go. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, that came out really good. It's still pretty warm, y'all. That came out pretty good. So now I want to cut into it. Here is the moment of truth. Let's see. Put that over there. Hope y'all got a good view. Okay, let's cut into it, y'all. Have mercy. Okay, the crust, that's kind of, hold on now. That crust was kind of, okay, sis. Hold on. Wait a minute. It's nice to see the bounce back. If y'all can see the, press that down, the bounce back moist. Okay, I'm a baker. I'm a baker. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. Hold up. Can y'all see that? That came out really, that is really moist. Look. Okay. That was a really easy recipe. Slice this up. I'm going to have me a slice of this tonight with some tea. And we going to be on and popping. Go me. Oh me. Listen, y'all, I'm pumped because I do not bake well. I eat I either over bake it or under bake it. This came out really good. I'm so proud of myself. So there you have it. If I could do it, anybody could do it. Easy as one, two, three. 
banana bread. Look at the inside again. Really good stuff. Okay, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video.